the master of the universe is Yahweh. 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 Another blessed Wednesday in the presence of the Lord. Yes. We know that in the presence of the Lord there's fullness of joy. And fullness there's, of and joy. His right yes, hand, there are pleasures, many pleasures yeah. forevermore. Yeah. Yeah. Come on in. Hallelujah. Wherever yes. you are, you can join in, you can share, Pleasure. you can like. Hallelujah. We give God thanks for each and every one of you that are joining in tonight. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you right where you are. We have an interesting and a hot topic. Yeah. And why we talk about a hot topic is because it's something that not a lot of people want to discuss or want to talk about. But mm -hmm. nonetheless, mm -hmm. we cannot shun from it. No, Amen. No, 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 no. So, Father, we just give God glory. Yes, hallelujah. 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 We thank you. Come on and just wherever hallelujah. you are, worship yes. the King of glory. You, wherever you are Check tonight, just up. lift up Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 
Hallelujah. We Hallelujah. worship the King of Thank Glory. You. Hallelujah. Thank we you, magnify God. His name. Yes, Hallelujah. God. Be thou exalted in this place. Yes, Be Lord. thou lifted on high in this place. Yes, Yahweh. Yes, yes, Hallelujah. Yes, yes, He's yes, El Shaddai tonight. Yes, yes. Hallelujah. He's Hallelujah. God in our midst. That we just hey. want to give thanks unto His most holy name. Thank you. He's worthy. Woo. Thank you. God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. He's Thank so, you. So, 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 so worthy. Yes. He's hallelujah! So worthy in this place. Hey, tonight. Hallelujah. You, Jesus. We bless him. Thank we you, bless Lord. him. We bless Thank him. You, Come Thank on and just give God. Hallelujah. Thank right you, where Jesus. you are, give God thanks. Thank you, Lord. Right where you are, give God thanks. Right where you are, give God thanks. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Unto you, Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Hallelujah. You're worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. You're worthy. Thank you, Jesus. We lift up your name this night. We lift up the name of Jesus. Yahweh tonight. Thank you. We want to exalt him above all. We want to exalt him who is above us. Hallelujah. He's yes. King of Kings and He's Lord of Lords. Yes, he right is. Hallelujah. He's yeah. Master of the Universe. Yes. Yahweh. Yes. Hallelujah. Hey. We just bless God. Woo. We just bless thank God. God. Hallelujah. Yeah. Tonight, thank Father, you. we just thank you for thank your you. many blessings. Hallelujah. Thank you for this line. We thank you, Father, for those that are online with us tonight. We declare this meeting, oh God, open. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. We are continuing where we left off. Father, we just commit, God, this life to you. And we thank you, God, for the those that are joining in, wherever they are joining in from. We thank you, God, that you, Lord God, is in the midst. We ask, oh God, that you will take your lead by your precious Holy Spirit. And that, Lord God, you'll saturate our minds and our heart. God, yes, cover God. the airway even now, God, from every unwelcome, oh God, yes, entry God. in the name yes, of Jesus. Name of Jesus. We Jesus. bind, oh God, every plan and every works of darkness yes, that we God. render null and void Not now void. in the name of the name Jesus. Name of Jesus. We declare, oh God, deliver on this life. Yes, we declare breakthrough. We yes, declare, Lord. oh God, Hallelujah. that, oh God, no weapon formed against us can prosper. Yes, Hallelujah. God. Hallelujah. We lift up the name of Jesus. We Hallelujah. declare that Jesus Christ is Lord on this broadcast. Jesus Christ is Lord in our lives. Yes, he Lord. is the Alpha and the Omega, yes, the very is. beginning and the end. He is the Hallelujah. author and the very finisher of our faith. And tonight we saturate this line as we come live to discuss pride, the pride that is happening in this month, a month that is set aside to, oh God, to celebrate pride, but we bring that spirit down tonight with the blood of Jesus Christ, and we declare that our King is King of Kings, and our Lord, He is indeed Lord of Lords, and He is the conquering Lion. We thank you, Jesus, that you will be exalted on tonight. You will be exalted throughout the universe universe. You'll be exalted in every circumstance. In the name of Jesus, as we commit, oh God, this broadcast, Father, we just thank you for your leading, for your directing. We pray, God, for those that will join in, that their lives will never be the same again, mm -hmm. my God and hey, my Father. Up, I declare, oh God, that, Father God, lives will be renewed, mine will be transformed. In the name of Jesus, we declare, oh God, deliverance in every aspect of the way tonight Lord God Almighty I call back a people yes. a nation that have gone astray Father God for whatever reason God whatever the plans and the, the attacks of the enemy tonight we declare righteousness on this line yeah. we declare holiness oh God without which no man can see God yeah. so tonight we invite each and every one and we ask that oh God Holy Spirit that you will saturate and that you will take charge and that you will lead by your precious Holy Spirit. We commit this time and we commit this gathering into your hands and we tell you thanks God Thank as you, you God. lead on in Jesus' name we yes, have Lord. prayed. Yes Lord. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Yes God. Amen. Yes, God. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Yes, God. We welcome God. Thank you so much for joining us. Yes, God. Hallelujah on the Natav and the Natav uh, podcast. 
Uh, it's, it's our new baby. Hallelujah. Amen. And we Amen. are just excited yes. about yes. what the Father has yes. been doing on this side of the vineyard. Yeah. Um, we started it on last week. We, you know, desired to, to go forth. Hallelujah. But when the Lord dropped the topic, it was like, mm. woo. Mm. It was mm -hmm. not anything that was planned that was mm. tell you this. Mm. But God knew what he had in mind Amen. for the month of June. Amen. And anybody who knows me and know anything about me know that I'm not a person that come live and do all of those things. So this got to be the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Hallelujah. <laughs> this yeah. is not my kind yeah, of a flow amen but hallelujah. nonetheless i thank the father for yes. deeming it so yes. that he would see fit to drop this in my lap amen you know? amen hallelujah i amen. just pray the stranger hallelujah and ask the, 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 the saints that are joining in wherever you are that you will also be prayerful where you are as this co co is concerned concerning the kingdom it mm -hmm. is concerning all of us that are part of the body of christ yes, and we is. do not want to make light of this matter the month of June has been declared mm. to be the month, hallelujah, that it is considered pride because Jesus. America um, gave it the okay. I have some a little mm. history on it and I'm just going to ask you just to uh, flow with me a little bit mm -hmm. that I will bring out some few things so that we know why we are here and... Um, and let the Lord have his way. Amen, somebody. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Very, very interesting. I was like, okay. A whole month. A whole month of um, giving it, giving God's month to a month of pride. Mm. And anybody knows who pride is? Pride is a spirit of Leviathan. Uh -huh. You know, that's not a spirit to be toyed with. It's a spirit, Jesus. you know, that wants to um, exalt itself. Hello here. Mm. Hallelujah. The spirit of pride is the very same spirit that that uh, was found in Satan, the son of the morning, mm. when he was in, 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 in his place of uh, worship. He was operating when God saw that, uh, when God checked him and saw that pride was already there in him he thought that the light was that was shining through him he thought that all those stones that was glittering go back and you read ezekiel 28 mm -hmm. and um you know um isaiah 28 and ezekiel 14 where you'll see that he said it was the pride that was in him mm -hmm. you know he became haughty within himself yeah. thinking that what you're looking at was all him but he didn't recognize that the light that shone through him was coming from god himself yeah on, somebody yeah, yeah, hallelujah yeah, so yeah, that's yeah, where yeah. pride when you know when you lift up yourself in pride you got to be very very careful god says he does not walk with the proud neither with the scornful uh -huh. so you got to be careful how we become prideful Amen. Uh, we have Amen. to become pride we don't want to become prideful in the presence of god no, no, because no. that spirit is a lucifer spirit jesus it's a lucifer spirit so we got to separate ourselves yes. in order for us to uh to be able to worship god in uh -huh. spirit and in truth god uh -huh. bless you pastor pilgrim yes, thank Lord. you so much for joining in thank you yes, our brother richard small thank you so much for joining in hallelujah thank god for you sir so long hallelujah but hallelujah. we give god thanks for your coming on this line tonight it's an interesting topic it's an important one to the body of christ because it deals with uh what the kingdom what we are we as christians are called to be submit subjecting ourselves to watch and to see the gallivanting mm. of um strange flesh on parade I don't know, I'll call it like it is, strange flesh. It is strange flesh, because yeah, yes. the Bible said it. The Bible uh -huh. said that it is considered strange flesh. Man lying with man, woman with woman. That's strange flesh. Strange. Come on now, Jesus. even lying with the beast. Mm. Hallelujah. They're animals. They're so-called pets. That's strange flesh. Big time. Ah, Jesus. yes, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. So tonight, um, the, the, the topic that... Um, that we are going with if since they can give a whole month to pride we declared on last week uh, mm -hmm. that we're going to continue through the month hallelujah by speaking about this pride because since yes. it's so important that america would acknowledge pride Jesus. hallelujah that they would acknowledge it and give it a whole month then we the christian got to take you know take it in consideration and begin to look 
hallelujah towards our God and uh -huh. begin to be prayerful because we know what pride is yes, we, we know what it means yeah. hallelujah one person said they're taking back their rainbow yes we yeah. are yes. hallelujah yes. hallelujah yes. hallelujah yes. hallelujah yes. so I say thank God hallelujah for those that see fit those that see fit and know that this the time has come for us to rise up yes. and to pray. If there was ever a time to pray, brethren, it is really now because yes. of what yes. the month has been declared. And how can you, or how can we be a, a part of the body of Christ and know of this and we're, we're living in it and we're seeing it, but yet still we are not crying out. The Bible said cry aloud yes. and spear not and lift up your voice like a trumpet hallelujah. tonight is the night to lift up our voice yes. hallelujah is the yes, night is. for us to turn our face towards the father and begin yeah. to petition heaven yes. in regard to this bill that has been released uh -huh. hallelujah jesus uh -huh. hallelujah so i took the initiative hallelujah to go through some stuff that i um yes, that i found out uh you know that um how this thing all began that it was back in some you know mm. in some it started well well even before clinton but clinton was one of the ones that um that signed yeah. uh the gay and lesbian right that uh -huh. he signed it was clinton who, who, who signed it and then obama came in afterwards and helped to push it along and took it from where it was where it was you know he, he brought the whole lgbt you know q uh -huh. and somebody said plus 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 yeah. and all of that so he extended it uh -huh. he, you know he co-signed to it yes, and did. um uh, one of the things that that brought my um that brought that to my attention is to see that the, the you know that these presidents would see fit to uh, make this an important thing that they would give to the spirit of pride and whatever you are a partaker of uh, whatever it is that they sign that means they are a partaker of that very same thing Amen. and they are trying yeah. to bring the yeah. very very thing yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. They, are, yeah. They, are, they are partaker of the very very thing because now what has happened is that now they are bringing in something and causing the nation that America would be subjected America in other words the church should also not should also be silent and not speak anything about it uh on last sunday the lord gave me a, a revelation in regards to mm. uh, the church and i want uh, my reader to help me mm. in regards to um the scriptures um matthew 13 mm. verses 33 i'm going to kick it off with that i'm going to kick it off with that there's some uh, i have a, quite a few studies here that i will be sharing with us but let's take note and so that we can know how? Because if you're going to deal with anything uh, spiritually, you need to get to the root cause of the thing, right? Yes. yes. You can't just deal with the surface part of yes, it. That's true. When there is really a root cause, uh -huh. right? So we got to get to the bottom of this and find out what and where this all really begun and where this uh, where where they intend to take this thing to. Amen. And we already know what they want to do with it because they are they are putting it in our faces exactly. not regarding that there is a God to be feared not regarding that you know that this is an abomination in the sight of God yes it is, it is still sin is still sin mm -hmm. you know and there is a holy one hallelujah there's a there's a holy god hallelujah that is still there and he is he, he, he's expecting us as the people of god the church that really is supposed to be the lighthouse yeah the church is supposed to be the one that has a voice which is a voice of the lord the voice of the holy spirit and the lord is calling us to come out from among them mm -hmm. and be separate if Amen. god be god then you serve him yeah and if Baal is Baal, then you go ahead and you serve him but you have to make a choice yes you cannot be in the house of the lord and not do i don't want to run ahead of myself because there's so much information and again i told you i will be on this topic god be my help uh i, I will be on this topic for the rest of the month hallelujah, hallelujah. as the spirit of the lord gives me utterance amen, yes. amen. hallelujah amen. so again i just want to encourage us to be prayerful in this particular month amen. because of what it is um 
Coming, what of what they have spoken it to be for, yes. and um, if you if you're if you stand if you if you stand up with this kind of a thing, then we already know mm -hmm. where we're headed. Mm -hmm. You know, yes. Hallelujah. So we got to make a difference here and begin to separate ourselves. Begin to separate ourselves from the things that will cause a reproach to come to the name of the Lord. Yes, Can I talk to God. somebody? Yeah, hallelujah. There hallelujah. are things that God, hallelujah, is calling his church to come away from. Yes. There are things that are perverting the church. Yes, it is. Can I talk about this yes, somebody? It please, yes. please, there are please. things that are perverting the church and we need to come to an understanding that we need to separate ourselves. Mm -hmm. And so again, when we look back into the history of things and we see it through Bible, uh, we understand that after the flood, uh, there was another thing that was likened to the flood. And we'll see that in the book of um, um, Genesis chapter 18, sir. Help me, help me out with that. Yeah. Genesis chapter 18, I'm going to help us. You can do take your notes. <coughs> We can take your notes. In the meantime, I will be, as he's finding it, I Amen. will be um, moving forward. It says, um, the official Pride Month, June, was declared to be the official Pride Month. Mm. That's what it says. June uh, is declared to be the official Pride Month. Hold on for a little bit. First, Bill Clinton, like I told you, if you're just joining in, it says that it was declared, Clinton declared it as gay and lesbian pride uh, in, the, in the year 1999 and 2000 to 2000. Um, he declared that. And then from 2009 to 2016, each year Clinton was in office. And, you know, he, he kept on pushing it. Then Barack Obama declared the LGBT Pride Month. And when he declared the month, um, he was um, that second. He seconded the motion to it and pushed it even a little bit further. Hello, wow. adding the pluses to it. Mm -hmm. Later on, then Joe Biden came and he added the, not only remember um, Clinton did gay and lesbian, mm -hmm. yes. but according to research, it says that Obama did LGBT. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Lesbian, gay. Uh huh. And all the rest Bisexual and what? Trans transgender. That's what L G B T means, yes. right? And then um, Joe Biden declared it L G B T Q plus. Queer. Yes. That's, that's so they're pushing it. All the way. Pushing it, and that was done in 2021. Wow. In 2021, that was pushed. <laughs> Okay, and so the history month, the history month for pride is really in the month of October. Mm. And it says that Wilson chose October for the celebration because uh, the first LGBT march on Washington was in 1979 and 1987 in October. It was National Coming Out Day. In the month of October, uh, October 11th to be to be precise, October 11th it was already declared that it would be National Coming Out Day. So you know, if, mm, I was going to say something, mm. but you know, yeah, there were that's their time. So October is their history month. Mm. However, June. Hallelujah, Lord, mm. help us, dear Jesus. Yes, June is their pride month, but wow. October is their history month. So he's just when up. they came out, their national coming out day. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, I do. When they come out from the DL. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. So now we are, God bless you, um, Dr. Lee. Thank you so much for joining. Praise God. Hallelujah. So we are, we, we, we are really, really into something here that they are pushing every year. Every, mm -hmm. every president that comes has to sign something towards it to push it. But what is God saying to us as his people? Mm -hmm. What is God saying to us? Why yeah. are we sitting back so quietly? Very. Hallelujah. When God, when the word of God says judgment begins in the house of God. Yes. We can't just be sitting by the way and just watching mm -hmm. and just looking. And some people say, mm, I'm not saying anything. Excuse me. I'm also, I'm also uh, uh, uh god bless you um um 
Minister Winston. God bless you, sir. Um, notice, notice this. Notice this. The enemy is pushing it in such a way where we will act. We supposed to accept it. Yeah. It's like yeah. rubbing it in God's uh -huh. face, and, and, and this is it. this is something that we cannot sit by and and just and take it lightly. God no. bless you, my no. cousin. God bless you. Not lightly. Ethan Owens. God bless you. So again. The, this pride thing, we got to really, really take this thing to God. We yes. really, really got to spend Amen. time. Amen. And not just time, but quality time mm -hmm. to spend. Because if they can push it in your face and in our children's face, where they want, want to be in the school system, they want to make it a part of the curriculum yes, that the children should learn. Hallelujah. Lord, help us, dear God. That the children should learn these things, which will cause them to become confused, not knowing whether they are going or they are coming. Uh -huh. But like I said on last week, if your father slept with another man, then how are you here? Jesus. Come on. Come on. Jesus. If your mother slept with another woman, how are you here? How? How did that how did that happen? How? Mm. My God. God made Adam and Eve. Eve. And not oh, Adam God. and Steve. Not at all. Right. It's ridiculous. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. That they're causing themselves to be fooled by the enemy. Mm. Yes. And taking it to extremes in sex changes. Yes. Not realizing that you're going to stand before a maker. Yes, you yes. will. Hallelujah. And when you stand before him, what are you standing there looking like? Wow. Oh my God. Hey, I feel mm. Jesus. Mm. What will you be looking like? Mm. Oh my God. What are you looking like? What are you looking like when you stand before him? They're taking it to another level. Mm. Another level thinking. You know, just being deceived. Mm. Oh my God. Deceived. Deceived. Going too far. Way too far. Is it your president that's going to answer for you? Mm. <laughs> Come on here. Mm. Your president cannot answer for you. No. no. And the funniest no. thing, these are there that we put in office. Yeah. Yeah, good for And this is what they have done. Right. They have signed a bill where you have to know you have to know watch this kind of a parade happening. Mm. And having our children to be subjected to teachers who don't think that anything is wrong with it. At all. Right. At all. And it's on your YouTubes. Uh -huh. It's on the Instagram. It's on it's on all of the networks. You name it, you find it right there. Mm. All this lewdness. Yeah. Everywhere and you turn. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. They're showing themselves. Jesus. God is getting ready to do something about it. And this is why he's mm. warning. For the word of the Lord says, yeah. hallelujah, that whatever God is going to do, he will first tell his servants, the prophet. Hey. In other words, it's time for us yes. to rise up and to begin to cry out. Yes. It's time because these people, it's not that God hates them. God no. don't hate the homosexual. No. What he hates is the very sin of it. Yes. Because it's an abomination. Yes, it's it strange. Is flesh in the sight yes. of God and God is telling us to come out from that thing out from that thing Jesus. and if you're a preacher you can't talk about it it's because you're a part of it mm. I'm in the body of mm. Christ and I can't keep my mouth shut cut yeah. I have sons and I have grandchildren yes. and I cannot sit by and be, and be okay with it no, no not at all it is not alright it's not it's not alright it's not it's not all right. Jesus. There is a God that we can, those who know the worth of prayer, you can pray. The worth. And you can pray sincerely. Mm-hmm. With supplication mm. and cry out to the Father and ask Him My to God. remove this bill. Hallelujah! Come on, somebody, you cried out to God that God will remove COVID. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And now COVID that called the wave of COVID that came and hit a whole lot of churches, a whole lot of members, a whole lot of people died out from COVID. That was likened to the days of Noah. Jesus. When oh God Almighty, Jesus. when Jesus. many swept away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Oh my God. And when we went into the lockdown, it caused us. Hallelujah, Jesus. That was the lockdown likened to the ark. Hallelujah. Where we were covered. Hallelujah. We were kept. Those that are still here. Oh but many were taken away. Yes. Many were taken away with titles. Yes. Behind yes. and before their names. Yes. 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 
Me the most stone man they be stone. Oh my God. Many with their titles are gone and no more today. No more. Oh God Almighty, no help us. No more. Oh God Almighty, help us. We need to rise up, church, yes, and begin to pray. Yes, uh, man of God, I'm going to ask you read for me Matthew 13. Matthew 13, verses 33, please. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick from there a little bit. Amen. Another parable spake he unto them. The kingdom of heaven is like unto le leaven, which a woman took and hid in three measures of meal, till the whole was leavened. The leaven. Mm -hmm. the first, if you hear what he read from, Matthew chapter 13, verses 33. He said the kingdom, the kingdom. Uh, I, I need you to understand something that, you know, when it comes to the kingdom, you have the kingdom of heaven, you have the kingdom of God. The kingdom of heaven is the earth rule of Jesus Christ as a son of David. And if you do your Bible research, I don't have the time now, but you'll understand that from David, he, said, he spoke that the throne, the throne, there will always be a king and that king will rise up from Judah. Mm. Yes, God. Hello. Yes, God. Hallelujah. So here now Jesus, who the now the kingdom of heaven being the earth rule for him. What happened is that he's now speaking what the kingdom is likened, what the church on earth is likened to. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh -huh. Oh God. When you when you, when you look at the church, it says it is likened to a woman who took meal and she hid it in the she hid the leaven inside of the meal. In other words, I was sharing that was our message on Sunday yes, it was. that this thing is likened to what's going on with the church that there's sin being crept in, mm. sin is coming in, Jesus. the lewdness, the oh God, the perverseness. Yeah. Uh -huh. Come on, somebody, oh is coming into the church. Yeah. And when you look, you see the choir leader with so fleary with a broken wrist. I talked about it last week. Yeah. The broken wrist of the, the the choir leader. Yeah. <laughs> loud, yeah, uh -huh. loud, uh -huh. loud. Loud. loud, loud, skipping and, and, and carrying on through the through the through the uh, uh -huh. through the church, yeah. and nobody's saying anything. Nothing. Yeah. Nobody's <laughs> saying anything. Some of these pastors, they are already a fish. Yes, I said it. They are already a fish. Jesus. You're already uh -huh. twisted sugar in your tank. Mm. Yeah. yeah? I said it. Mm. Sugar in your tank, you're sweet. Gotta say it. Mm. But you feel that you feel and you know that the thing is wrong. So nevertheless, as long as you keep your mouth shut, uh -huh, I ain't got nothing to say. You know, mm -hmm. I, 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 I'm, I, you know, I'm not with it. But guess what? Guess what? These, these, these things are are in our pews and it's in the pulpit, and we got to address them. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Amen. We got to address them. Amen. Because it's coming in. The Bible says a little. Leaven can leaven the whole lump. Oh. You know, more righteous more than I am. The fact that you know about it, I will not do nothing about it. Amen. Mm -hmm. Nothing. Mm -hmm. We're all a part of it because it's in our church. Mm. Ah, it's in our house. Mm. And we're not saying anything. Why? Because they have rights. Hmm. Because they have rights. Uh huh. We're not going to say nothing. I'm not going to touch it yeah. because I don't want to lose my job. Mm -hmm. Because I don't want to lose my business. Mm -hmm. Come on here, somebody. Mm -hmm. So you're rather to muzzle the mouth. Mm. Wow. Mm. Mm -hmm. Silent the Holy Ghost. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Don't want to talk about that. Mm. Uh -huh. Some of them don't even share the flyer. Because guess what? My God help us, Holy Ghost. Mm. Some of them don't want to share the flyer because what? They are not a part of that. Jesus. They don't want none of the smoke to come towards them. Mm -hmm. They don't want the smoke. Mm. So therefore, they keep far. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Pretend like they don't see it. Exactly. Some of them like Nicodemus creeping at night, peeping. Yeah. I watched the video afterwards. Mm, I'm going to say it. Come on now. I'm going to say it. But the writer said Proverbs 16 verses 17 it says that it is an abomination for kings for kings which represents presidents mm, mm -hmm. for kings to commit wickedness this is wickedness yes it is yes it is this is wickedness and trying to get people to submit to it Jesus yeah. trying to get people to add to 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 to, to conform to it mm. it's wickedness mm. 
is wickedness. Mm -hmm. We gotta rise up and pray. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. We gotta talk to God about this. Take this seriously as a prayer point. Lord, help us, Lord. Hey, God Almighty, we gotta take it as a prayer point and begin to address the matter mm -hmm. in prayer because our God is able to deliver. Yes, yes. He is. Hallelujah. Come on, here, Daniel yes, chapter two. Hallelujah. Daniel spoke about that he will not partake of the king's delight. Mm -mm. Yes. Mm -mm. Don't partake of it. You go back. Ah, you got to boast mm -hmm. about. When you look into the book of Revelation, it also talks to you about Hallelujah Babylon and her delicacies that all nations have eaten of it. Mm -hmm. Come on, America. Yeah. Come yes, on, America. Yes, yes, yes. All these delicacies mm -hmm. they have caused them to be eaten. Mm -hmm. We need. We need deliverance. We need to be. We need to be yes. praying. Yes. Jesus. Yes. yes, we do. God mm. bless the prophetic office. God bless it because it points us to the direction that God wants us to go. Yes. But we need the word of God to begin yeah. to go forth yeah. that yeah. people will know. Hallelujah. What is the requirement for the kingdom? Yes. Yeah. What are the principles of the kingdom? Yeah. It's not okay for you to be a leader and lay hands on people, picnic, and people, children, excuse me for those that are American. Mm -hmm. People, children, knowing that you're kind of fruity, mm -hmm. you have liquid sugar in your tank. Mm -hmm. no. Know that you're looking sideways. Mm -hmm. Help me, Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. Help me, Holy Ghost. It's an abomination for kings. Mm. To do wickedness, said the word of the Lord. Jesus. For the throne is established in righteousness. Yes. yes. The throne must be established with righteousness. Yes. My there was a king called Asa, my God, who took over from his father after his father passed. Mm coming down. God help us, Holy Ghost. They were descendants of David coming down. And then you have Ahab and then they all came down the line, Rehoboam and so forth. So when you find Asa, Asa was one of them mm -hmm. who did not carry on with his father's work having the male prostitutes okay. inside of Koshete, yeah. inside of the temple. You understand? Oh God help us, Holy Ghost. Oh, Some Lord. of these leaders who know that there are other male having male prostitutes in the kingdom. Having male prostitutes my God. My God. Hey. My God. Mm. Help me, Jesus. Yes, God. Lord. Help me, Holy Ghost. Jesus. Help me, Holy Ghost. Jesus. Help me, Holy Ghost. Deuteronomy 23, verses 17 said it. Deuteronomy 23, verses 17. Man of God, if you can read it real quickly for me. Because I have a whole lot here. Deuteronomy 17. Deuteronomy 17. Yes. Amen. And God says, yeah. Thou shalt not sacrifice unto the Lord thy God any bullock or sheep wherein is blemish. Or no, any... Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy 17. Oh, 23. I'm sorry. 23. Deuteronomy 23. Grab your notes, people. I'm giving you the cause that there is a cause for us to pray. Yeah. There's a reason to pray. It's not okay to just close your eyes mm -hmm. or turn your face the other way. Mm -hmm. It's not okay. It's not. He that is wounded in the stones or hath his private member cut off yes. shall not enter what into the... What verse? What verse are you reading? At the first. No. Yes, verse, verse 17. 17. There shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel. There shall be no whores of the daughters of Israel. Nor Sodomite of, Nor the, sons Sodomite of, of the sons of Israel. What are we talking about? Go now mm. to uh, Genesis, I think it was what, 18? Mm -hmm. how, do, how do we end up where God gave the, 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 the bow, the rainbow, as a sign to man? Yeah. That there will be no more flood. Come on. Mm -hmm. That was the, the promise of God. Uh -huh. yes. Because he knew according to Second Peter chapter 3, you'll find it where God says that he'll come, he'll deal with us in another way by fire. Yeah. Yeah. So he says, when he looked and he saw what happened in the earth, he said, No more will he cause this to happen. And he yes. gave to Noah and to men that th that this will be a sign of my promise to you. And now, if you notice how wicked the enemy is, he took the very thing that God showed as yes. a symbol for his promise and tried not to pervert it. Yeah. Come on. Just That's like right. That. 
Jesus. Oh God Almighty. Exactly How ironic is it that the COVID wave hit mm -hmm. man, hit the earth, all over the earth. COVID hit like a wave, mm -hmm. like a massive wave. It yes. hit yes. every mm -hmm. nation. Yes. Hey God Almighty. It was likened to the flood of Noah. Woo. But then afterwards, man of God, watch this. Here now, after you find that COVID is now dying out, look what you see coming up now. Pride. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It's a false rainbow. Wow. It's a false Ooh. sign. You can't take the rainbow. Hey. I can't, I can't you can't take that rainbow. Take God rainbow. No, you can't. Cut. Sure. 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 Your false rainbow. False rainbow. Who are you, you uncircumcised Philistine? Who are you? Who are you? You're mad from the Marian kingdom. The devil is a liar. Right after you want to declare, you want to come out in the month of June to declare your pride, the rainbow, the devil is a liar. You are a false. You are false. You are false. The rainbow is coming back. The rainbow is for God's people. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Hallelujah. The perverted spirit. Jesus. It's for God's people. It is for God's nation. Yes, it is. Come on now. Come yes. on. Mm. Yes. Let's go to Genesis 18. We're going to see where all of this begin. Amen. And the Lord appeared unto him in the plains of Mamre, and he sat in the tent door in the heat of the day. I, think I want to go down. I want the verse to, that um, the, the angels visited. And Noah had to, um, Abraham had to plea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Abraham had to plea because uh, uh, th there was there was something that took place. <laughs> you know, I, 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 while you're finding it, sir, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about it a little bit, and you know, I will be paraphrasing a little bit. However, watch this. Here, here, God using Abraham at this time to show how much God had respect for his friend Abraham. That God will cause warning to come to him. Yeah. Look at it. Lot went down. Lot was the nephew of Abraham, and he went down. When he went down to uh, 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 went with um, Abraham, Hallelujah. The Bible says, and I'm jumping I'm, uh, and I'm giving you the understanding of it. Uh, when he went with Abraham, the herdsman, their herdsman got into a, a little, you know, friction. There was some friction among them because there was not enough space and their cattle were growing and stuff was, you know, they were increasing. So now the herdsmen begin to argue. However, to make a long story short, Abraham, and I trust you know the, the, the story, and to those that don't know it, take your Bible and get to it. It's in, uh, it's in uh, Genesis chapter um, 18. You find that Abraham now gave him the option to choose. He gave him the option to choose, and when he chose, he says to him that he needs, he, 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 he can choose whatever side that he would want to go so that there may be peace among them. I'm going somewhere with this. That there will be peace among them. Now, watch this. Because of the greed of Lot, Lot chose, he looked and he saw a, the, the side that looked more flourishing in his eyes. Yeah. And the Bible said that he went in that direction. Do, do you have it? She said, is it, is it 19? Um, but it begins on minute. Okay, we're in 18, where Abraham got the, the visit. Abraham got the visit from the angels and he was pleading with them. But if you're in 19, 19 no, is I'm, where? I'm in 18. I'm in 18. Okay. Okay. I'm going to start right at, I believe, at 11. Okay. Now, Abraham and Sarah will hold no chicken. No. Is anything too hard? Okay. Go to, go to 19. Go to 19. Amen. Because I'm already sharing that. Okay. Okay. So, again, look at this. Look at what brings us to this place. It's 19. Go ahead. Amen. And there came two angels to Sodom at even, and Lot sat in the gate of Sodom. Lot sat where? In the gate of Sodom. So when Lot went his merry way, thinking that he got the better part of God's promise to Abraham. Mm -hmm. huh? Mind you, it's not for him promise. It's not his. Mm -mm. It's, not his. it's not his promise. Not his at all. No Come on here. It's you see? No wonder why God had to separate them. Yeah. Mm. You understand? Because what he actually believed, you see, had he stayed with Abraham, 
Had he stayed with Abraham, he would have felt entitled to the blessing. Amen. There would be some entitlement, yes, feeling amen. like, okay, I've been with you. I feel like the, a part of this blessing is mine. Yes. So God caused a friction to happen between the herdsmen. Mm. And now the, the, the plan was, okay, take the best part. Take the part that you see fit and you go so that we can be in peace. Yes. And now the word is opening up in the 19th chapter uh -huh. of the book of what? Genesis. Yes. yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. When you read Genesis, it's telling you in the 19th chapter, it's showing us now how Lot was near. Where did he plant himself? Read it, sir. And Lot seen, then rose up to meet them and bowed, bowed himself with his face now, toward Now, read one. the verse that you've started. One. Was it one? 19? Yes. And there came two angels to Sodom at, at even. Mm-hmm. And Lot sat in the gate of Sodom. And Lot sat in the gate. Now, think about it, people. He sat within the gate. Mm -hmm. So, what am I saying to us as leaders? You can't be halt in between opinion. Mm. It's either you're in or you're out. Yes. Jesus. But he was sitting in between. <laughs> yeah. I'm talking to the in between ones. Yeah. You don't you want you, you want and you don't want. I see it if God is God serving, yes. yes. My God. If God is God serving, mm. so the fact that Lot sat at the gate, he was neither in and he was neither out. Mm. Mm -hmm. And so work started up with these five kings, and he ended up was taken captive. And so God, who's so faithful in his, all his ways, went to Abraham because he had covenant with him. Mm -hmm. yes. And because Lot was his nephew, you see, when you're connected to people. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You see how God can show mercy when you're connected Jesus. to certain people. Yes, <laughs> when you have the right connection. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Yeah. God said, I will show mercy. Yeah. And whom I choose to show mercy. God, I yeah. thank yeah. you, Lord. I Holy thank you. Ghost. Hallelujah. I will Hallelujah. show your mercy. Yeah. Mm, to whom yeah. I choose. Because God knew that he was there. God had a plan for Sodom mm. and Gomorrah and the other cities. Zohar and the other cities that mm. were attached to it. Yeah. But God recognized and remembered that the thing would grieve um, Abraham. Mm. So he, he stopped by the way. Cause the angels to stop by the way and says, Go and tell him. No wonder why I'm gonna go back there again. The book of Amos. Oh, hallelujah. Where God says, He does not anything he's gonna do in the earth, he first reveal it. Yes. To his servants, the prophets. My God. Come on hallelujah. here. So he showed it to Abraham yeah. the plan that he was about to do. He said, The cry and the violence that is so much in Sodom. I'm about to go and destroy the city. Mm -hmm. So hear now the plea, the prayer. Come on here. The petition that Abraham put in. That he was crying out for the city. He said, listen. Even if 15 of the city. Save the city, Lord. Save yeah. it. Save it. Yes. Mm -hmm. He went down, counting down, down, down. Till he even saved 10 is in the city. Save the city, master. Mm -hmm. Even so, he went down. Mm -hmm. And the angels left and went. And upon entering into Sodom, and I'm talking, and when I'm talking, I see some churches are literally Sodom. Jesus. My eyes was open to it. Some churches are literally Sodom. Jesus. Cover me under your blood, Jesus. Some churches have become Sodom. What are you talking about? I've seen. I've seen with my own two eyes. I've seen churches mm. that are literally, mm. literally from the top to the bottom, Whoa. is nothing but sodomite. Mm. Mm, I've seen it. I can't even give you the address. Mm. Mm -hmm. I can give you address. Wow. Literally from the top to the bottom, mm. nothing but sodomites. Mm. Mm. Nothing but male prostitutes in the house of God. Kosher mm. tie. And I'm a sutabaka sabaya. And it is okay, and they're screaming and they're crying out and say they're praising God. And they and the keyboard and everybody dancing and screaming. Mm? My God. Those are serpentine spirits. Mm. Jesus. Mm -hmm. mm. Being charmed. 
Those are the serpentine ones. And you can play the keyboard and you see them, or them wiggle up and them start to run up and down. Mm -mm. My God. Help, mm -mm. Lord. Not God. Mm -hmm. Not God. Not the God that I know. Amen. Amen. Not the God that I serve. No, Amen. sir. Amen. Not the God of Abraham, mm -mm. Isaac, and Jacob. Mm -mm. Not that God. Mm -mm. Come on, somebody. Mm -mm. Hallelujah. Mm -mm. Hallelujah. Come Hallelujah. on here, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey. We must stand for we must we must we must stand up for something. Yes. If God and God serve him. Mm. Watch this. So read on for me, sir. And there came two angels to Sodom at even, and Lot sat in the gate of Sodom. Mm -hmm. And Lot seen them seen, then rose up to meet to meet them. And he bowed himself with his face towards the ground. Mm. And he said, Behold now, my lords, turn in, I, I pray you, mm -hmm. unto your servant's house, and tarry all night, and wash your feet. And you shall rise up early, and go on your ways. Mm -hmm. And they said, Nay, but we will abide in the street all night. Mm -hmm. And he pressed upon them greatly. And they turned, they turned in unto him, and entered into his house. And he made them a feast, and he did bake unleavened bread, and they did eat. But before they laid down, the men of the city, even the men of Sodom, can pass the house round. round. So they saw the angels, and they started to curfew the place. Mm -hmm. Yes. Stalking <laughs> it. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. they see new meat, fresh meat. Jesus. They saw fresh meat coming in. Mm. Uh huh. I know it. <laughs> Read on. But before they lay down, the men of the city, even the men of Sodom, can pass the house round, both old and young, all the people from every quarter. And they called unto Lot and said unto him, Where are the men which came in thee this night? Bring them out unto us, that we may know them. And Lot went out at the door unto them and shut the door after him. And said, I pray you, brethren, do not so wickedly. Behold, now I have two daughters which I have not known man. Mm. Let me, I pray you, bring them out unto you. And do ye to them as, a, 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 as is good in your eyes. Mm -hmm. Only unto these men do nothing. For therefore came they under the shadow of my roof. Mm. And they said, stand back. And they said again, this one fellow came in to sojourn. And he will needs to be a judge. Now... Now will we deal worse with thee than with them? And they pressed sore upon the man, even Lot, and came near to break the door. But the men put forth their hand and pulled Lot into the house to them and shut the door. And they smote the men that were at the door of the house with blindness, both small and great, so that they wearied themse themselves to find the door. And the men said unto Lot, Hast thou here any besides son-in-law? And thy sons and thy daughters and whatsoever thou hast in the city, bring them out of this place. Mm -hmm. For we will destroy this place because the cry of them is waxing great before the face of the Lord. And the Lord hath sent us to destroy it. And Lot went out and spake unto the sons-in-law, which married his daughters, and said, Up, get you out of this place. For the Lord will destroy this city. But he seemed as one that mocked unto the sons-in-law. So they mocked. Lot, mm -hmm. when he spoke to them, the sons-in-law mm -hmm. started to mock God, mm -hmm. mock Lot at his beckoning to them to come out from among them, to run out mm -hmm. of the city. Uh, I, 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 and, and understand this also, understand this also, that when he was beckoning to them, if you notice the word that it says that they have come to destroy the city, yeah. you understand? Because pride was there. Mm. Come on. Mm. And so the destruction was now coming. Yeah. The pride was bringing the destruction. Yeah. Okay. And the word says, heartiness before a fall. Yeah. So the destruction mm. came. Yeah. And they still could not understand. They did not comprehend that this was now something that is about to happen. Uh -huh. Help us see your Holy uh -huh. Ghost. Uh -huh. You see, let me tell you something. God, God did not even see. Five righteous in the land. Hmm. Not, even five. Not even five was in the land righteous. Jesus. Wow. Read it. It was a lot. His, his wife almost made it. And his two daughters. Yeah. She almost made it. Hmm. Because her heart was already hmm. in Sodom. Jesus. Yeah. 
Yes, her heart was in Sodom. Yeah, because you do have people that they are married, but still yet they have fleshly desires. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. sure. So her heart, Bible said, wherever your treasure is, that's where your heart is. Am I correct? You're correct. Yes. Am I in the word? Yes, you are. Is it my opinion? No, no. Hey. So wherever your treasure is, that's where your heart is. Yeah. So Lot's wife became a pillar of salt because her heart was there in Sodom. Jesus. Come on here. Jesus. Probably just so a matter of time before she would start entertaining it. There you go. There you go. Come on. Uh. And if you notice, you don't hear nothing about Lot's wife. All you hear is when she turned pillar of salt. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. So her heart became corrupted. While she was there. While she was there. You got to be careful mm. where you set yourself. Wow, yeah, Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Because if you position yourself in a certain place, your atmosphere can also lure you in. Mm. Yes. So yes. true. So yes. true. My God. True. You see? <laughs> My God. Oh, God. You ever hear this said, birds of a feather flock together? Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, you're in the company. How you think? How, how do you think that Samson was defeated? He kept going down because what? Something lured him there. Yeah. Not that he didn't. He had an awesome anointing to defeat the Philistine. Yes. But beyond the fact that he had the anointing to defeat the Philistine, he also was enticed. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh-huh. Big time. He was also enticed. So he didn't go down there to defeat the Philistine. He go down there to lay with his Philistine girlfriend. Yes. So he was not on the Lord's assignment. Ah, oh. somebody help me, man. Wow. Mm -hmm. He was not on the Lord's assignment. Wow. He was is busy putting his head his head in the lap of Delilah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Come on here. Yes. Wow. He went to go get his stuff. Yeah. You know. Yes, he did. Mm -hmm. Yes, he did. He was not on no assignment. <sighs> wow. Way to bring you got to be careful where you bring your anointing. Come on. Mm. You got to be careful. Yeah. Mm. You got to be careful, Samson. Yeah. Because the enemy just want to know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Come on. Yeah. So watch this. Upon him being there, it was the very, very thing that he was born to defeat. Mm -hmm. Took his grace, took his anointing. Jesus. Oh my God, my God. Jesus. Mm -hmm. The environment, your company. Mm hmm. Mm. The company. Yeah. He was to destroy and not partake of. But he was what? Lustful. Mm -hmm. And it took him into that place. Mm -hmm. It took him into that place. Mm -hmm. Turn on the ear. Yeah. It took him into that place where he became mm -hmm. lured in. Watch this. So now, what am I simply saying to us here? We gotta be careful. Men and women of God. Yeah. These days, if you really value your salvation, and I'll say it again, as I said last week, salvation may be free, but there's a maintenance plan. Yes. Mm. You got to maintain what you have received. Amen. Yes, amen. amen. It's amen. not once you're saved, you're always saved. No. Am I talking to anybody here? Yes. You it's not once you're saved, you're always saved. You got to know. And make sure you protect what God has given unto you. Yes. Amen. Help us, yes. Amen. Amen. Help us here, Father. Yes, Lord. The Bible begins now to show me as we were doing some studies. And it began to open my understanding about uh, um, some, some worship that was being done. Remember King Asa? He was the one who took, who, 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 uh, Release down the the, 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 the the prostitute, the male prostitutes. And the Bible talks about how much that he walked not in the way of his fathers. However, the high places were still there. Sure. There were altars that were still erected yes. to Ashtaroth, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. to Jezebel, to those spirits of perversion. Mm -hmm. Those altars were still there. Jesus. And so when I did my studies, I recognized that as I was going through, it talked about in a, in a, uh, the, what you call it? The Asherah poles. Mm -hmm. I'm going there. 
Yeah. As I opened up and the Lord began to give me some revelation, he started to show me the Asherah poles. And I began to ask, what is this Asherah pole? And I did my homework. I started to do my studies. And it started to show me in Deuteronomy chapter 7. You can go there. Deuteronomy chapter 7, verses 5. Chapter 12, verses 3. You can find it there. Deuteronomy 16 and what? 21. I can read a little bit of that for you. He said, you shall not plant any tree as an Asherah besides the altar of the Lord your God that you shall make. So there was an Asherah pole. It was called, in the Bible it's called the Asherah pole. Yeah. These days you have the men that are also, God help us Holy Ghost, you know, <laughs> because they're so perverted. They have these poles now, you know, where they like to do the pole dance. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm going there. Mm -hmm. I'm going there. You. These men that wear the wigs, mm -hmm. flashing the wigs with a different color. Uh -huh. oh, Bring them back to the Asherah pole. Mm. Uh -huh. These were the things that they used to swing also on. Uh huh. Then you have the Christmas tree. That is a whole other thing. But the Asherah pole, and it is when I did my research, it said one of the Asherah pole is also in New York. It said an Asherah pole is in Washington D.C. There's an Asherah pole that is in London. Hey, mm, like yes, that. yes, yes. Go do your research. Mm. Mm. These are poles that was erected for Asherahs. Jesus, my God. Ain't nobody. stood up Wow. For the what? For the male prostitute, the sodomites. My God. It was a type of worship. That's wow. messed up. Yeah. That's messed up. It's a type of worship. Mm -hmm. So they end up to become slaves mm -hmm. to the spirit. Jesus. My God. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Serving in the groves. Instead of serving, you think you're serving in God's altar. You're serving in the grove of Ashtaroth. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Because this is the desire Jesus. that is not of God. Oh, God. And man may not see it altogether, but God knows the heart and knows the lust of the eyes yeah. and the pride of life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. So the Lord is telling you to come out from among them. It's calling repentance to come to the sons of God. My God. It's time for us to get back to the old landmark. Amen. Hey, post your Holy Ghost. Amen. It's not okay for you to just sit by and by and watch. My God. Mm. And not cause something to be said or to be done. Yes, mm. something. Mm. something. Help us, Holy Ghost. Yes, mm. my God. Help us here, Jesus. Mm. Help us here, Jesus. Mm. So I, I encourage us tonight. While you're here under the sound of my voice, God is speaking to us as a people. Mm -hmm. And he's calling us to the attention to let us to know that we have work to do. Amen. Amen. We have work to do. And the work that we have to do is not, is not something to be made light of. Mm -hmm. Because these are going to a crisis eternity. Yeah. And it's, again, I repeat, it's not that God dislikes the people. He does not hate anyone. Come on here, somebody. But what he hates is the very sin, which is an abomination, oh God, in his sight. God cannot look upon it. Mm. Yeah. Look upon it. He can't look upon it. Wow. And because of that, we are being, uh, unfortunately, men are being deceived. Mm. And the fact that they are being deceived, and, and they're taking it to another level, mm -hmm. where they're turning their bodies, Jeez. they're causing their breasts to come forth. Mm -hmm. Some of them, I, I, I learned that they are now taking the dead bodies mm. of women mm. and they are removing the womb mm. and putting it, in, installing it inside of a man My God. so that he can say he's bringing forth. What a wickedness. Mm. What wickedness. My Lord Jesus. Oh God. What wickedness. Oh God. The exit Ooh. has become man's entrance. My Lord. My you have lost your identity. Not knowing who you are or whose you are. Fully. No wonder why we're waiting upon the sons of God to arise. Mm. But they are busy in the groves oh. of Ashtaroth. Jesus. God help us. Jesus. 
But there's a righteous generation, there's a remnant that God has set aside for himself. Mm -hmm. And a people that will cry out. Yes, God. Yes, Lord. A people that will declare, thus said the Lord. Yes, Lord. God Almighty. The word of the Lord also shows that these are they that kill out the prophets, that stone them. Mm -hmm. When they come to release the word, when they come to cry sin, that they kill them between the altars. Jesus. Help us, Jesus. Oh, Help us. They said, if we were here as our forefathers, we would not have done this. Go read it. Mm. They said, we would not have done what our forefathers have done. We would not partake of it. But Christ says in the parable, he said, you are the sons. Yeah. My God. You are those sons yeah. that have killed my prophets. Mm -hmm. My God. Killing out the prophets, stoning them. Wow. Lord. Killing them between the pews and the pulpit. Between the altar. Somebody come and preach in righteousness. You stone them. Who she think she is or who he think he is. Yeah. 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 Because the word cuts. There you go. The Bible says, Oli Alabando Staba. The word of the living God is sharper than a two-edged sword. Yes, yes. It cuts, it pierces, mm. even to the very dividing asunder, the yes. joint. It goes through the marrow. Jesus, Why? Because have to cut out yes. that yes. nature from us. Yes, yes, That yes, sinful yes, nature. Yes, yes, yes. My God. Righteousness is still right. Holiness is still right. And without yes. it, we can't say, God, Amen. clean hands and pure heart is what God is looking for. Yes. You can't speak about it. If you can't speak about it, it's because we have become a part of it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? But because there was a few in Sardis that kept their garments, and for those that are keeping their garments, cry out yes. Yes. for our next generation. Oh my God. Cry out for our sons and our daughters. Oh Lord, help us. Cry out against the spirit of perversion. Yes. Open up your mouth and declare the word of the Lord. My God. God is able to deliver. God is still able to secure, to protect. Yes, yes, God is still able to save. Yes, Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, Don't God. just sit yes, by the way and say nothing. Mm -mm. My God. Mm -mm. And turn a deaf ear. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. While they are parading themselves. Mm. As it were in the days of Sodom and Gomorrah. Mm. America, what are you looking for? After pride, there's always destruction. Yes, yes true. This is where we are headed if we don't learn to pray. Ooh. My God. Look at COVID. COVID barely, barely just gone. You don't nobody take heed. In 1999, it was given that June will be the month of celebrating. October to be the month that you celebrate your history. Of coming out. Mm. Where are we going, America? Where are we going? Where are we going? This series. Where are we going? Mm? This series. If God didn't find four righteous in Sodom, mm? Mm. stop the hypocrisy in the house. Yes. You don't need to be in God's house mm. with a broken wrist. You don't need to do that. You don't need to be in God's choir. Choir people, choir leader. You're fishy. Mm -hmm. You're sweet. My God. Hey. My God. Not going to like me today. My God. Preach the word. Mm -hmm. There are some. Mm -hmm. There are some that they like the company and some of these family members support their family members. Oh, I'm not it, but I'm supporting my sister. I'm supporting my brother. Or I'm supporting my aunt or my uncle. Stop. You're an accomplice of everything. Yes. You're a partaker of it. Yes, you are. Mm, God, I help, 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 help. Help your people, God. Please, Lord. God is coming back to judge his house. Righteousness is coming back for his house. Yes. Welcome. God is about to judge his house and he's sending out a clarion call to call us back to turn our face all backslide in Judah. Mm. Come back. Jesus. Break up your father grounds. Yes. And repent. 
My God. It's not okay. Oh, my God, Lord. It's not okay. Forgive us, Lord. Jesus. You know that there's some part of the Bible, some people don't preach it because they can't. They can't. Mm -hmm. Simple. They can't. Speak you can't it. preach it because you are a partaker of that. Speak mm -hmm. You can't preach it because you're guilty of it. Mm -hmm. You can't preach it because, guess what? You know, I don't want to say anything because, guess what? You don't want to lose your job. You don't want to lose a friend. Mm -hmm. You don't want to lose your congregation. Mm -hmm. Listen, mm -hmm. I've got church. I only one blood shed for the church and it's Christ. Hallelujah. My blood can never shed for nobody or anybody's church. Hey, Sabalo. Never will, don't have no desire to. Amen. Hello. Amen. I'm just an under shepherd mm -hmm. by the grace of the Almighty God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, and Lord. trusting and praying that I don't preach others in and me myself be a castaway. Mm -hmm. So I have to cry out. Yes. Jesus. Hallelujah. I have to cry out mm. for the sake of my children. Yes. For the sake of my sons and my daughters. For the sake mm. of my grandbabies. Yes. I have to cry out. Yes. It is not okay. Mm. It's not okay to make okay. Mm, a sodomite teach your children. Mm. It's not okay. I'm gonna call it like the Bible called it sodomite. Sodomite. I said it. Yes. Because they feel offense. Mm -hmm. They take offense when you say, when you call them Sodomite. But that's what God called you, Sodomite. Yeah. Yeah. He said, go there. He said, I'm going to wipe out Sod Sod mm -hmm. <laughs> Sodom and Gomorrah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take offense. Hurt my feelings. Mm -hmm. And so what? Better your feelings get hurt than you lose your soul. Come on. Amen. Come on. Come on. Amen. Don't lose your soul. Hey, Baba Baba Sata Bible says, whatever brings you offense, it's a cut it off. Mm -hmm. Cut it off. If the thing is an offense, then you cut it off. Mm -hmm. It's best you're going to the kingdom of God with one eye. It's best you're going there with one foot or one hand. More than try to be making it. Cut it off. Whomever the individual is. And you may cry out, you may beckon, you may call them. It was, it was God who used Abraham to bring Lot out of Sodom. Yes. 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 And even when his deliverance came for him, and the angel says, Go up into the mountain, he asks, Can you can you can I can you and my family go to Zoar? Mm -hmm. When Zoar was also supposed to be consumed by sulfur. Jesus. My God. Go read your word. My God. Jesus. My God. Jesus. He had the nerve. The angel literally had to grab him and pull him out. Mm. Mm. God is still merciful. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. By me talking to us tonight, I'm literally grabbing somebody and pulling you out. Mm. I'm grabbing you out. Mm. Hallelujah. My God. I'm snatching you out from yes. pit of hell. I'm snatching you out from the sulfur, the brimstone that is coming. Mm. That is coming. Jesus. God does nothing without warning. Amen. This is a warning is to the warning. sons and the daughters of God. God. The Judah, Judah come back. Israel come back. Yes. Jesus. Don't get caught up. Mm. Don't get caught up. My God, my God. The book of Revelation, they saw the Son of Man and he was coming down with a cloud over his head and with a rainbow. Yes. The promise of God. Yes. Mm -hmm. The promise of God is coming back. Mm. Yes. You can't pervert what God has given to us as a no. promise. Hallelujah. The devil is a liar. Hallelujah. The rainbow belongs to us. It yes, belongs it to the church. Yes, it does. It yes, belongs it does. to the people of God. Hallelujah. Look at what they said that it belongs. Their color. They took God's color. Mm hmm lord jesus and he said that this is what it means to them what a condition they said the pink means their sexuality my lord and the red means life the orange means healing yellow means sun green is their nature blue is art indigo is harmony and void for their spirit are you serious they named it. Wow, well, I didn't even know that. They named it and they created a flag to represent how presumptuous. How presumptuous. How this is just stirring up for the destruction of God to come. Mm -hmm. It's to provoke God. Yeah. Mm. 
It's provoking God. Yes, it is. Jesus, yes, Jesus. It is. Do we not understand that this is provoking the hand of God yes, it is. to rise up against America? Mm. Yeah. We are under the umbrella of America. We cannot, we cannot just sit by because with, with, with pride comes the destruction. Uh -huh. And from destruction, heartiness comes with the fall. Yes. Where are we going Jesus. if we don't cry out? Jesus, oh Jesus, Jesus. Where is our next generation? Are we going to lead them to leave them to confusion? Mm. Come on now. Mm? Are we going to leave them to confusion? Mm. Come on, somebody, talk Jesus, to me here. Jesus. Are we going to leave them to confusion? No. No, we got to do something. We got to pray. We got to pray loud. We got to talk to God about this. Yes, yes. Because yes. God is not pleased. No, it's not. Can Imagine the heart of God, the stench that is going up in a month like this. My Lord Jesus. Can you imagine the stench before God's eyes? The stench before his nose, his nostril. When the prayers of the saints, where is the prayers of the saints? It's supposed to be as a sweet smelling savor going up into his nostril. Mm. Jesus. Mm? The Bible says, Lord help me, Holy Ghost, that even when we pray, God is still faithful and just to forgive. He's still yes. able. Yes, yes. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. He's still able. Do not provoke his hand Thank you. to bring destruction to the city, to the country. Yes. My God, Lord help us. Look what has happened to us. Jesus. We are exposed to all these lewdness. Mm. Jesus. Mm. We are exposed. Pride has gone out. Mm. And destruction is now coming. Jesus. Jesus. Pride has gone out. Mm. Pride is being celebrated. Mm. Mass. A mass celebration going on. Mass mm -hmm. celebration. A mass celebration. Yes. Because of these kings as presidents mm -hmm. that have signed the bill. Yep. And pushing it. Pushing it. Because of their perversion that is in their own hearts. Speak it up. The perversion of their own heart. Hmm? They're pushing that gays should have their own month mm. to parade themselves mm. when they know the story. It's not many days. It's not. It's, it's, it, there's a time coming when they will even, and I believe that there's also a Bible for them. They have also prepared a Bible for themselves, wow. where they don't want to read certain part. Okay, <laughs> as if they have a heaven to put themselves or a hell. There is a Bible. Far away from rumors. I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to tell you. We are, I have so many. I have so many notes here. So many notes. Mm. So many notes to share with us about this particular thing. Like Comes that. October, they are going to celebrate their history of their coming out. My Lord Jesus. Can you imagine? Just as we celebrate Black History Month yeah, yeah, in February. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just like mm? that. Wow. <laughs> the spirit of perversion have a history month. <laughs> that they literally put it on calendar. The spirit of perversion yeah. has a history they month. They put it on our calendars. It has a history month. On our Google calendars. It's on the Google calendar. October, the month of history. The great coming out. No shame. No shame before the Lord. No shame. No fear for God. Yeah. No reverential fear. None, none. none. That none can deliver us out of God's hands. The Bible says it's a fearful thing to fall in the hands of an angry God. Hey, oh, God. It it's a fearful yeah. thing. Who can, who can bear that? Ooh. That's a dreadful thing. <laughs> My God, help us, Holy Ghost. Um, think about it. It's a dreadful thing for us to be in the hands of an angry God. An angry God. Mm. Because this is what pride is doing. It's stirring God. Yes, it is. And because, oh, thank you, Father. Because the Bible says God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten. It is the love of God why Christ came. That's number one. And he's still be begging. Paul says, I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God. Who am I speaking to? I'm speaking to the church, mm. the ecclesia of God. Why are you quiet? Mm. Jesus. Why somebody don't call a prayer meeting already? Mm -hmm. yeah. Why isn't there a solemn fast called already? My 
by those great leaders that are in great positions. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. Those well-known leaders that hold. Nah, they won't touch it. <laughs> Why are they not calling? It's because their pews are loaded. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. With them. I'ma yeah. say it. Yeah. May never get an amen on this platform, but it's the truth. Mm. Doesn't change it from the truth. The only let me tell you something about truth. Truth comes naked. Yes. Uh -huh. It does not wear clothes. Truth don't wear clothes. You don't cover truth. Mm. Where are we going, church? Mm. Where are we going? We need to cry out. Yes. God is calling for us to cry out. There's a cry that must come. Uh, 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 the wailing women, the cunning women, mm. as it was called in the book of J Jeremiah. Where are the mothers? Where are the wailing women? Mm. Where, why, why the church is not travailing? Mm. If there's no other time for a, for, for a watch night and, and an and a, and a all night prayer and you name it, everybody the church, when there was 9-11, you find so much people gathering for 9-11 prayer. So now why is there no one calling prayer My God. against this thing? Against this why? thing. Why, why, everybody why? just get complacent and relaxed. Mm. Speak up. Nobody have nothing to say. It's not, I don't have anything to say. I, it's not my business. I, I, I just mind my business. As they sing this new song, drink water and mind your business. Not this month. Mm -hmm. not, not this month. Not this month. <laughs> not this month. Don't drink water and mind your business. Not this month. Not this month. Because anything Hallelujah. pertaining to the kingdom is your business. Yes, yes. Hallelujah. 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 Yes. If it's in the kingdom, Hallelujah. it is your business. Yes, yes, Come what you're not against, you will become a part of. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, yes. My God. Thank you, Jesus. My God. Thank you. Jesus. So I'm going to speak. I'm going to speak. Thank you, Jesus. And I'm going to let it be known. Yeah. It is not okay. It I'm calling for the intercessors. I'm calling for the prayer warriors. My God. Mm. The Asherah pole is, is something. You know, those that are online with me. And you know, people love the pole dancing. Mm. Pole dancing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Thank God my eyes have never behold it, literally. Thank God. Thank God God spare my eyes from seeing it literally. But people talk about pole dance and all of that. Go and check where it's coming from. Mm. Go check it. Go check it. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. My Lord. And these sodomites that is walking around with these long hairs. Shaking themselves. Vibrating themselves. Oh they are acting more more feminine than the women because yes. they have to prove that they are supposed to be feminine oh yeah i'm gonna talk yeah. about it yeah. in fact yeah. it's in our face so why not why i can't talk about it if it's in our faces talk about it. So, talk about it. Talk about it. it's in our face yes it is and they are not they are not being shameful about it mm -mm. because it's called pride mm -hmm. and what pride is haughtiness jesus and what heartiness brings? A fall. A fall. Mm. That's the word of the Lord. It brings a fall. Jesus. When Satan was prideful, the Bible says what? It caused him to fall. Come on here. Help us. There's a falling that's about to take place. Even, even, even in prophecy, it is said it. It said that there shall be a great falling away. Not just a falling away, but a great falling away. Why is it why is it so underlined? Why is it such an emphasis of great? It's simply because it's happening right in our eyes, right in our pews. Yeah. Right from the pulpit people of God. Yes. Those that were sitting in heavenly places, some of them are falling. Those that you hold and we esteem them in high places, we are losing them. Yes. Jesus. Because the iniquity of the heart, what is iniquity? I told you last week, iniquity is what no man can see. Yes. God said he had to search. He had to search the heart of, of, of um, Satan. And he said, when I searched him, he found iniquity within him. So iniquity is what you cannot see. But what iniquity does, it breeds the fruit. And the fruit is the very action, the very deed. Jesus. So one can be there nursing that thing. 
mm. and petting the desire mm. to sleep with another man, to sleep with another woman, desiring strange flesh, uh -huh. sound, you can hear a pin drop. <laughs> it's the truth though. Yes. Desiring the strange flesh. But if I if I can't tell anybody, you're looking at the, you're looking at boys and you're looking at you're looking at female and you're having you're having desires that you should not have. Mm. But you're not talking to God about it. My God. Find someone that you can confide in and talk to them. Yes. Ask for prayer. Yeah. Don't just sit there and die. Yeah. The falling away is happening as we speak. Yes. Mm. Because they are great, great, thank you, Jesus. Mm. They are great leaders that are in the pulpit and they are not a hundred percent. Yes, I said it. It's My true. God. It's true. I said it. A little level leaven the whole lump. It whole the whole lump. So don't think you're not a part of it. Mm. The woman, the, 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 the parable of Jesus Christ says the woman hid, hid the leaven inside of the meal. Mm. And the leaven represents sin. It represents evil in the church. Jesus knew that it would happen. And this is why he's raising up the voices. Right. He's raising up the Elijahs to come out, cry out. The, in the spirit of Elijah is to restore the hearts of the father oh and the heart of the son back to the father oh and the father back to the son. That's the spirit of Elijah to bring restoration. Oh Call them to come back to repent. Help us, Jesus. Hallelujah. Help us here, Jesus. Come on, somebody. Yes, Lord. So we have work to do, yes. and we cannot sit by and by no. and expect that you know when we don't say anything, it will just go away. Mm -hmm. No, it's gonna increase. It's gonna get worse. It's gonna get worse. If you don't pray, if there is a people to pray, then there's a God to answer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm gonna say it again. If there's a people to pray, then surely there's a God to answer us. Amen. Nice. Nice. But you got to pray. It's a seek. We'll find, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. It doesn't take God by surprise. Yeah. The parable that he gave mm -hmm. with the measure of meal, it didn't take him by surprise. He said the kingdom will be likened. Yep. Like In other words, you're going to see it's, he likened it to something that we can understand. Yeah. How sin will creep into the house. Yeah, Jesus. Oh. Jesus. And he goes a little bit further. And it talks about, thank you, Jesus. About silly women being laden, taken. That's the church. That's the church. People rising up saying that they know God. The sons of Belial. Eli's sons. It was said in, 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 in the book of 1 uh, first, uh, first Samuel about them from chapter 2. It talks about them that they did not know God. They did not know God because what? They were sons of Belial. Yes. Sons of the devil. So because they did not know God, they did some lewd things. Yes, they did. Jesus. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. There are ministers that are in the house that say that they are preachers and pastors and they are this and they are that. But they still don't know God. Mm. True. They don't know God. True, mm -mm. true, true. And they're taking the church captive. Yes, they are. Mm. Help us, Holy Ghost. Please, Lord. Please, Lord. We are beckoning to God tonight. My God, Lord Jesus. And we are crying out for help. I'm crying out and I'm calling the intercessors. I'm calling those, hallelujah, who knows the word of prayer that you will rise up. Get up. Move from out of that place of complacency mm -hmm. and start to talk to God. Yes. Because the pride is stirring God's hand to bring destruction to America. Oh my God. And we cannot afford the destruction. Mm -mm. My, mm -mm. Jesus. my God, help us. Yes, yes, yes. There's a heart cry tonight. There's a heart cry. God bless you, Pastor Bridges. There's a heart cry tonight. God is calling us from among them. Yes. 
Yes. Learn to walk circumspectly, not as fool, but as wise, redeeming the time. Yes. Because the days are evil, says the word of God. Yes. How can two walk together if they don't if they if they don't agree? Mm -hmm. yes. God is calling us Jesus. to pray. Yes. Pride month should never exist. No. Mm. And because it is here, we have work to do. Yes. Because it's gonna cause yes. our children to be subjected, mm -hmm. yes. mm? and we have to preserve the next generation. Yes. We have a job to do, yes, we do. and we have to preserve them. Yes. And how do you preserve them? God gave it to the Israelites when they were coming out the Hebrew people when they were leaving Egypt. He said, "Bind the word of God as frontlet between your eyes, yes. and also as band, put it around your arm." Yes. Hallelujah. You got to learn to keep the word of God. Hallelujah. Train up a child in the way that they should go. That they will not depart from the truth of God's word. Hallelujah. You cannot. You cannot spear the rod to spoil the child. No. Don't leave your children to Facebook. Mm -hmm. Don't leave your children to TikTok. You don't know all kind of stuff is on there. The all kind of lewdness is on there. Yes, don't just leave them because you love them. If you love them, then you protect them. Them. Come on. Protect Jesus. their little eyes. The Bible says, touch not, handle not. Go yes. oh, laba shanda laba yes. saya. Yes. You know, the, you know the, 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 the great, the great um, King Solomon. He wrote it in the Proverbs. He said, there, there's, there's two things that is never full, and it is the eyes and it is the grave. Mm. My God. Yes. My the God. eyes and the grave is never full. So what am I saying? They will always want to see. I want to see. I want to see. But it's not everything is good for you to see. Come on. Amen. Amen. That's the truth. You got to protect your eye. You got to protect your eye. You got to protect your eye gate. Yes. Because when you watch certain things, especially pornography, come on, people of God, yes. leave pornography alone. Yes. Because it is a gateway yes, it is. to perversion. Uh -huh. Yes, it is. It's the truth. It's the yes, truth. Yes, it is. It's a gateway. Leave, leave pornography alone. My God. Yeah. Christian people, tongue talking people, Holy Ghost filled people, leave pornography alone. It's not for us. Come on. It's not for us. Come You're on. opening up gates mm -hmm. and doors to spirits that you can, you, you will regret that you did. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Protect what you hear. Protect your ears. Protect your eyes. Mm -hmm. My God. Jesus. Can I talk to us? Yes. I just have a few more minutes left before we, we start to pray. Hallelujah. Just a few more minutes. Jesus. God is calling us to repent. Yes, yes. Start where you are and repent. If you have family member, pray for them. We don't hate them. But we have to pray for them. Mm -hmm. Because God did not cause them to lose their lives. Mm -hmm. But they have been taken captive. And we, know, we, we read it in the book of Deuteronomy 23 and 17. So God says, let there be no whores or sodomite in his house. Yes. Mm -hmm. Stop pretending as if it's not there. And sometimes we just laugh and we giggle. And we think that it is okay. It's not okay. Because the very thing that you laugh, you laugh at, that very thing can become the chicken can come to your roost. Mm. My God. My God. It's not a funny thing. Jesus, before he departed in his earthly ministry, he said, my father's house is a house of prayer. Yes. Another den of thieves. Yes. Come on, somebody. My God, yes, Lord. My house must be called a house of prayer. Yes, yes. God. Yes. Hallelujah. It's not for us. It's not for us to do whatever we want to do. No. But bring back prayer. There's no prayer in the schools. Mm -mm. Why? No. Because they are bringing in other worship. Mm. No you can't talk about Jesus. Why? Because there are other gods. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. So what are we going to do? Pray. Huh? Yeah. Be like the children of Israel when they cried out. And God took Moses, there will be a deliverer. Mm. 
God will raise up deliverers yes, in every household, in every family. God will raise up deliverers. Hallelujah. Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. My God, I give you the glory. Hallelujah. God will raise up deliverers wherever it is Hallelujah. that you are. Hmm? God. And because God heard the cry of his people, Israel, he said, I've heard the cry of my people and I've come to deliver. Yes. Hallelujah. If we just pray, God will hear and answer. Yes. Amen. The word of the Lord says, while we are yet praying, God is answering. Mm -hmm. Don't allow God to send the angels to come and bring destruction to America before we start opening up our mouth. Mm. My God. Because we don't know, you see, many churches, but not every church is church. Mm -mm. Come on now. Not every church is God's house. No, not every church is named the name of the Lord. No. True. Help me, Holy Ghost. My God. Now, light me today. My God. That's the truth. Not every church is church. Not every church is church. Not everywhere that you see open up and you hear them, they, they're knocking and carrying on. It's not the real worship. Yeah. I remember when Moses was up in the mountain and while he was in the presence yeah. of God with Joshua, the Bible said that Joshua said, I heard the sound of music playing. And Moses said, no, it is not. Hallelujah. You got to recognize that there's a sound that God knows. Oh, there's a sound. It's not every time you hear a tambourine or you hear, it's not necessarily the sound mm -hmm. of God. Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. Hallelujah. Come out from among them. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. God starts Hallelujah. with the house of God. Yes. Hallelujah. He's cleaning in his own house before he can go out and clean another man's house. Glory to you, God. Hallelujah. What is the house? Start from within. Jesus. Hello, somebody. Hallelujah. This is the first temple. Start clean here yes. first. Yes. 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 And then when you start to clean here, then you can't start clean around and about you. Yes, God. But you can't clean around and about you when the inner man mm -hmm. is giving you a problem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The inner man is giving problem mm -hmm. because it has desires that it shouldn't have. Mm -hmm. It's lusting for things that is not Jesus. within the parameter. It's not mm. supposed to be. It's not a part of God's plan. Mm. God. The word of the Lord said it's considered strange flesh. Strange. Some of us take our pets a little bit too much. Mm. And, we, and we huggle and we cuddle and we have them so close to the point where the dog is also tongue kissing the master. And the master kissing the dog is too far. Way too far. It's gone too far. That's too much. It's gone too far. My God. Mm -hmm. Strange flesh. Bestiality. Come on, church. My God. Come on, church. People carrying their dogs to church. What where, 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 where you get this thing from? <laughs> where you get this thing from? Oh God. So true. Bringing your dog to church. Where you get this thing from? So true. Mm. There's a line. Don't yes, cross it. it. Yes, it is. It is a line. There's a line, don't cross it. Mm -hmm. The church is God's house. Yes. yes. But because we have lost the fear and the reverence, but I tell you this, God is bringing it back. Yes, God is bringing it back. Yes, he is. You don't want you to be the example. We don't want us to be the example. Because mm -mm. God is looking for the church to shine. Yes. God is looking for the church to speak. The church do have a voice. Yes. But why is the voice silent within us? Mm. My God. Why is the voice silent? Why is there no pastor coming out and, and, and having a public and even gathering? Move the segregation from out of the church. The politics from out of the church. Come and on. go next door to your next door neighbor. Because everybody's striving to go to the one same place. It's not two heaven. It's not ten heaven. Come on. Hallelujah. One, heaven. one way to glory. Yes. Jesus said he's the door. Man. Come on. Amen. There's no other door. Jesus is the way. Yes, yes. So if you're coming through Jesus, hmm? <laughs> then how is it that your church is more righteous than the other church? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Get ourselves together. Yes, if there's ever a time that the unity should be, is now. Yes, yes. The church should be coming together as one. Yes. Coming together as one mm -hmm. merging together for one common cause yes. 
and it's to see the move of God. Yes. When we get I love you, Holy Ghost. When the when the apostles got filled in the upper room, there was something that was done to bring them the Holy Ghost. They were in one accord. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Everybody was in one accord. And the one accord, the fact that they were in one accord means that they had one mind. Mm. They worked out their differences. Mm -hmm. They stopped pointing at Peter and telling Peter, you denied him. The next one said, oh, you shut up because you was also, you was also um, a doubter. Mm -hmm. Oh, what, what you talking about? The other one said, yeah, but you, 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 <laughs> you had seven devils. You know, they have to work out their differences yes. yeah. within the span of time yeah. as they tarried in God's presence. Mm. And as they tarried, they were waiting and they were waiting until everything was sorted out. And the Bible says, and when they were all on one accord, yes, hallelujah, hallelujah. there was a suddenly. Mm. We want a move of God. Yes, yes. And in order for us to get it, we got to get together. Yes. Amen. One, the word says, one chase what? A thousand. A thousand. Mm -hmm. And two put ten thousand to flight. Right. Mm -hmm. Yes. But uh, how are we going to put anything to flight when we're still struggling and the ism and the schism is in the body? And the enemy knows that this is the way to divide and conquer. Uh huh. You against you, you against you. So therefore nobody, aha, uh -huh, so now I got it. Jesus. Hell is very organized. Hmm. <laughs> Hell is very organized if you don't know. Hmm. Satan knows rank. It's us that don't understand. Mm -hmm. Satan understands authority. It's we that don't understand. Amen. So if the church come together and see the cause, the word of the Lord said, is there a cause? There is a cause. Yeah. How can you stand when, they, when, 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 when Goliath came up against the children of God? Said, yeah, there is a cause. Yeah. You have to rise up. Yes. Yes. So you uncircumcised Philistine, who are you? Mm. Come on. Mm -hmm. yes. And with five stone, he beheaded. Yes. yes. That Goliath. We need to come together and yes. gather up and call on the name of Jesus to take down this Goliath. Yes. Because he's defying the name of God. Yes, he is. How dare we sit back My God. and watch the month of June be taken because of pride. My God. Pride is something. That we don't need. Mm. It brings destruction. Yes, it does. Oh, God. Huh? Lot became a widow because of pride. Mm -hmm. His wife's heart was left wow. in Sodom. And to show you how much he didn't want to leave Sodom, he asked to go over to Zohar. Mm. Hmm. Hmm? And to the point where God said he speared Zohar. Why? Because Lot was there. Wow. Mm -hmm. yeah. Connect with the right people. Because yeah. it is because of his connection with Abraham. Why God was able to save Lot. Because Lot was in between the gates. Mm -hmm. In between the gates. <laughs> he was neither in and he was neither out. Mm -hmm. Because your, your, your environment can affect you. True. Yeah. yeah, you'll be around it too long, it can take you out. Mm. True. And, you know, not correcting things is to say that you're a part of it. Yeah, so we don't need, we don't need to see destruction come to America. Mm. We are all under the umbrella of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at all that is going on. Shootings. 
Babies are being killed in school. Oh my God, Jesus. Come on. Why? Because there's no prayer. Why? Because of this kind of perversion. Mm. And the preparation to celebrate a whole month. Mm. Oh so where is the spirit of God supposed to be? How? How? When we are the ones in the way. Open up your mouth. It's time to cry. My God. Oh, I'm calling for the wailing women. I'm calling for the men that know how to pray, that know the worth. The leaders that are really, really, really standing up for what is right. Mm -hmm. What is right? We all have things that we need to, t to pray about, but nonetheless, how this should affect this affects the body of Christ. This is something that is pushed in our face. It's an mm -hmm. insult. Yes, yes, it, is. yes, yes it, it is. is. This is It's an insult. The Bible said the earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. Yes. This Lord. is my father's place. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. This is my God's house. Don't just sit by. Say something. Don't partake. Yeah. Tonight I trust that someone heard what I'm saying. Yes. For the next couple weeks, maybe next what? Three, four more weeks. Mm -hmm. We're gonna be here. Two more. This is the second week. Mm -hmm. No, I think we have three more. Okay. Yeah, there's there's um okay. three more Wednesdays that is in this month. And uh, we're going to be talking more about this because there are some, some topics that I've not yet touched. And I want to get into it. Salvation. God is still able to save. Amen. Please understand this. If you're struggling, you're all in between opinion. If you're not sure, please cry out before it's too late. Ask someone who knows how to pray. Someone that really, really, really is connected like Abraham. Mm, hallelujah. Mm? That when he heard the message, God deemed it worthy to go and tell him, your nephew is in trouble. Mm -hmm. oh, your nephew is in trouble. You have that grace to cry out and to pray. Thank you, God. So tonight as we are closing on this line, I'm going to pray and I'm going to ask each and every one of you wherever you are just to begin to open up your mouth yeah, Lord. and begin to talk to God pertaining to this matter because as we are speaking they are celebrating as we are speaking somebody else's son or daughter is being, is being initiated someone is turning into that direction but if we pray it can bring change. Yes, God. So Father, tonight in the name of Jesus, we bring before you this month of June that man has placed and declared to be Pride Month. Yes, Father, we come against it in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Lord, we take back, oh God, this month of June. And we declare that it is a blessed month. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, the month of man. It is the sixth month. The month that we declare yes, a month for God. For a month for Jesus. Yes. I pray for the conviction. God, send your Holy Spirit into the heart of man. Oh God Almighty, those yes, consciences that are already seared yes. with an iron. God, I pray tonight that you will save, you will deliver, that you will bring healing, God. In the mighty name of Jesus. Lord God Almighty, touch the hearts oh God. Let oh God Almighty our people be turned back unto you again. Even as John the Baptist ministered God at the Jordan and he called and he beckoned that men will repent. Yes, Tonight yes, I yes, beckon yes. oh God My that God. Israel will come back, that yes, the church yes, will return, remove from the hypocrisies yes, and begin to repent, yes, begin to cry out back again yes, to Jesus. God. He's able, he's faithful, yes, he's yes. just to forgive us. Yes. Oh God Almighty, I cry tonight for America. I cry tonight for a change. 
I cry tonight, my God, for deliverance. I pray, God Almighty, for the church and the pastors and the bishops and the apostles, God. I pray, God Almighty, for the head department. I pray for the fivefold Father that they will see the need, that they will see that there's a cause and that they will rise up, my God and my Father, and that they will declare what is just and what is true and what is right. You said, oh God Almighty, sin is a reproach to any people tonight we come against every reproach against God's house and against the people cover our children in school cover them God even as they're getting ready to come out Father God for the summer season we pray protection over their minds we pray protection over their bodies we pray protection from the perversions God Almighty that you cover their little eyes cover their little minds oh God let no gates be open God protect them God Almighty from the lewdness Lord Jesus I cover them now my God from the pedophile in the name of Jesus the blood is against you we declare wholeness oh God all round and about in the mighty name of Jesus father we cry out to you tonight that you cause oh God the parents my God to rise up and take account oh God accountability Lord God for their children oh our next generation God show us how to preserve my God show us how to pray and not pray and miss God that we will miss anything that you're doing in this time and neither in this season I pray my God and my father that everyone on the sound of my voice will be moved will be provoked tonight to pray in a unique way that this matter will become a prayer point and that no longer will we be comfortable my God the word of the Lord declares by the rivers of Babylon where we sat down and there we wept when we remembered Zion we cannot sing the Lord's song in a strange land father I pray tonight for deliverance I pray God almighty for a change of mind I pray for the arrest of hearts God that it will be transformed oh God almighty that they'll see the need to cry out and ask for repentance in the name of Jesus save our loved ones God from this untoward generation father deliver I pray right now from the spirit of perversions my God almighty in the name of Jesus I put before you this need Lord as an urgency at this time for the sake of our next generation I cry unto you my God tonight in the name of Jesus that someone will watch this go oh God broadcast and that they will be pricked in their heart and that they will turn again God and come back home to you that they will repent of their ways and that they will recognize my God and my Father that you God coming back for your church I call forth oh now coach a revival I call forth a breaking out I call for deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus I call for the people God that they will rise up the sons of God let them arise even now in the mighty name of Jesus I call them now God to raise up oh God even now a prayer watch in the mighty yes, name yes, of Jesus God, God. let there be an awakening yes Lord yes Lord yes my God. the body of Christ yes my God bring us back I pray father Lord God protect us from this destruction from the spirit of pride Father God, break the pride that is in man right now. Break that spirit of pride. Break, oh God Almighty, this, this lewdness, this perversion that is going on right now, Father. In the name of Jesus. And we take back June for Jesus. And we take, oh God Almighty, a righteous stand tonight. In the name of Jesus. I thank you for those that are in support. Father God, of this broadcast, I thank you, God, for those that see fit that that this righteousness is still right and that holiness is still right I say yes. thank you Lord sanctify again your people Lord sanctify cover the children cover the babies yes. in the name of Jesus and grant to them my God a safe home protect them from molestation protect please, them from yeah. pedophiles yes. ah my God Lord please my God. in the name of Jesus ah, please, father hedge them the about in school hedge them on the road Hedge them in the daycare. Yes. Hedge them, yes. God, all around. In the mighty name of Jesus. Cover their little brain, God. Cover their minds. Cover their little hands, God. In the name of Jesus. These are, oh God, our Samuels. 
our Jesus. Davids, yes. Father God, take control. Yes. These, oh God Almighty, yes. are our, oh God, yes. Ibaba Soto yes. Yes. even as they use Gideon to bring down the pole of, of Ashira. Yes. Father God, every pole of Ashira, yes, let it come down in the Bro. name of Jesus. Yes. These poles that they are using, God, I come against it in the name of Jesus. My God Almighty, it's like the serpent that is wrapped around the pole. We come against it in the name of Jesus Christ. And we declare holiness tonight. We declare righteousness tonight. We call upon the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Because we know that he is alive and he is well. And as he has sent Moses to deliver, so will you send deliverer for your people. In the name of Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let oh, the Jesus. pastors repent, O oh God, yeah, that are heart in between opinions. Jesus. Let those, O oh God Almighty, that are in the worship area, let them to see God yes. and to come, O oh God, to repentance. Yes. I call forth, O oh God, hallelujah, hallelujah divine yes. repentance to the body of Christ. Yes. Yes. That we will cry out like never before. In the name yes. of Jesus. Yes. Father, remember those that are on this yes. broadcast. Yes. Cover their household as well. Yes, Lord. Cover their families, God. Yes, Lord. Use them as our God. Use them, dearest Jesus, as the mouthpiece, yes. God, for yes. you. Yes. Yes. Lord God, that they will speak and they will speak all right. That they will do thus set the Lord, my God Almighty, and that they will still choose, mm. hallelujah, righteousness. Yes. That they will still choose to yes. serve you in holiness yes. in the name yes. of Jesus. Name. My God, Lord. Yes. Come on and give God hallelujah. the glory. Hallelujah. Come on and give God praise tonight. Hallelujah to you. Hallelujah. God is still faithful. Hallelujah. I repent for America. I repent for America. Father, forgive us of our shortcomings. Yes, forgive us of where we falter yes, and come God, short of the glory. Yes, forgive us, God, and cause us to be restored again. Yes, Restore again, my God, the joy of your salvation. Those that are struggling, God, bring forth help. Send them in a direction where they can get assistance and where deliverance can be made for them. Yes, Lord, help them, Lord. We thank you. We praise you, God. Yes, God. For you that we have asked, oh God, is faithful and just to do it. My God, you will make good on your promises. And we thank you, Lord, that you, Almighty God, cares for us. Ah, we thank you that our names are written upon the palm of your hand. So tonight I commit the church into your hands. I commit the broadcast. I commit the Facebook. I commit the Instagram. I commit the Zoom. I commit my God and my Father, even the podcast right now, under the blood of Jesus. And that God, those that will watch it hereafter will be convicted and will remember to come back home to you. As the prodigal came to himself, so God let your people come to themselves, those that have fallen along the wayside. I pray divine restoration in the name of Jesus, every heart of apostasy, yes. that it will no longer turn from God, yes. but that it will come back, turn from the wrath of God, yes. and come back to his mercy on tonight. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Name of Jesus. Jesus. We thank you. Jesus. And we praise you. Yes, Lord. And as we Hallelujah. close out tonight, Father, Hallelujah. anyone that desire prayer, and anyone that desire to, to talk with me, or to, for me to pray with you, you can inbox me. All right? You can inbox me. I'm going to make a, 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 a group. I'm going to make a, a information where you can reach me, where you can inbox me, you can, that I can pray with you, I can encourage you, and maybe direct you some, to some helps in your neighborhood, in your community. You know, but don't just sit by and die. Mm. Don't, don't, don't participate mm. in what is an abomination. Yes. But stand apart. Come out from among them. Righteousness begins in God's house. Make a difference and say something. Whomever it is, call their attention. The Bible says, He that winneth a soul is wise. So I pray for the wisdom of God to crown us today. That we will see the need to cry out and spare not. Yes, Bless now we pray God as we depart from this place. But never from your presence. Yes. Cover us in our night rest tonight. Yes. That we will not be disturbed oh God. And cause us to dream heaven in a special way. In the name of Jesus. I declare it oh God on this line. Woman, boy, girl, whomever you are.
are, God is still able to deliver. God is still able to save. Trust him. Make your petition known unto him. Cry out to him. And he is able and he's faithful to save. Tonight, hallelujah, if you're under the sound of my voice, you can also be a blessing to this ministry. Hallelujah, even to the Nataf. Praise be unto God, which you can post the dollar sign, AFISM. Hallelujah. Or you can give... You can uh, give through the Zell, which is also Gay Owens twenty two at gmail dot com. Amen. The Nataf. Hallelujah. It is the word drop. God is speaking to His people tonight, yes. and not just tonight, but here tonight begins something that God don't want the church to be quiet any longer. Yeah. Wherever you are, you may not come on Facebook, but you have a church. Mm -hmm. You have a pastor. You have maybe somebody in the family. Talk about it. Yes. Let them know that Jesus still saves. Yes, Lord. Jesus, they can still come back. Mm -hmm. And God is faithful to deliver them. Mm -hmm. All right? Mm -hmm. Again, for your giving, if you want to be a blessing to the ministry, the Nataf, which is by Zell, you can give gayowens22 at gmail.com. And if you want to also give... Uh, via cash app in his dollar sign A F I S M. You can do that now, right where you are. The Lord will bless you for the same. And if this meeting has been a blessing to you, and you trust and pray that you have enjoyed and you are uh, pricked by the word of God, that you will tell someone else about it, and that you will also share it and you know encourage someone, pass on the information so that. Uh, you know, they can come for prayer. They can come seeking God. And we are here to pray. We are here to pray. Yes. Amen. Amen. God is faithful to his people. Yes, yes. And God is warning. This is a clarion call for those, hallelujah, to turn back again. Mm -hmm. Come back. As the prodigal came to himself, come back to our senses. Yes. And let's return back to God. Yes. Hallelujah. hallelujah. And the Lord is able to save us. Yes, Father, we just thank you again as we go from this land, never from your presence. We say let the words of our mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable in our sight. Oh Lord, you are our strength and you are our redeemer. And we all say, Amen. And Amen. God bless you. Thank you so much for joining the Nataf Word Drop on tonight, where our topic for this month is homosexuality. Tonight's topic was pride before the fall. Yeah. Pride before destruction. Okay? Yeah. Keep praying and the Lord will bless you for the same. God bless you. You have a wonderful Christ centered night in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Amen.